So random rare relic for 6 HP, that's perfect. Nunchaku, I like it. So now Blade Dance is common. So we can get Nunchaku value with Blade Dance and stuff like that. I'm, uh, I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, we can do... Two Elites. I didn't rest. Nah, I didn't rest. Because I was like, uh, 15 life, alright. I, I'm not resting, there's really no justification to be honest. Because I think Dreamcatcher alone was worth it. But it's a Nunchaku run, guys, so let's try this out. We got Nun Nunchaku. Nunchaku. Thank you for the follow, Lazis and Nick28. Thank you, guys. Welcome. Blade Dance. So this is exactly what I actually was trying to get. Blade Dance is not common, and I got Nunchaku. Let's give it a whirl. That's hilarious how it comes together like that. What well, is common, so you expect to find it. I think Skewer is really good, but so is Noxious Fumes. Um, who's the boss? I think Noxious Fumes is like a free win against the Guardian. I think Piercing Will is pretty good for 26 gold. I mean, a lot of things are free wins against the Guardian, but let's upgrade the Neutralize. Okay, we're drawing over for two elites, so let's go for... We can always do... We don't have to do the second elite. Let's see what happens. Every 10 attacks played. Yep. 10 attacks. Make sure to follow FPS Thailand. Going for some ships. I like the the blade dance change. I think it's pretty cool. It gives you energy. Yes, energy is such a good resource. Okay, we're taking dodge and roll this time. We talked about it. I neglected it. Dodge and roll is a perfectly fine defensive card, and I, I shouldn't have neglected it. And I'm sorry, dodge and roll. I hope you forgive me. I hope you forgive me. We've got energy here, which is actually not a good term to use it, but like you know, just a. I'm not really looking for the value right now, because I'm going against the Jaw Worm. But like, if I saved it for this turn, this would have been a nice turn to get that extra energy. Mark plays, thanks for the follow, man. Appreciate it. Welcome, guys. How you guys doing? Uh, he's gonna... This is not gonna kill him, so let's go ahead and do this. Dodge Roll is actually such a good card. I feel like I've been neglecting Dodge and Roll, and I feel so bad about it. We got Nunchaku stacked up. Got Cow Traps, Backflipper. I think Cow Traps is really good to get more damage. I think Backflip is really nice. Especially if I'm gonna go for like a zero cost uh, slices and stuff. I think Backflip is always a nice defensive card. I'll take the Backflip, although maybe Cow Traps is better. Let's upgrade this and let's upgrade the Blade Dance next. All we need is Ornamental Fan, guys, and this is probably like sexy, sexy, sexy. What's up, JP? How you doing, brother? Amir, how you doing, man? Welcome. Yeah, a little late, Amir, but it's all good, buddy. I still love you. Free a, a free strike, pretty much there. Do I take the damage? I'll take the damage here. Oh, Kunai Shuriken would always be nice. Yeah, that's a given. It took me a while before I realized that this is actually um, a, a rat, a dead rat upside down. I never knew, I never realized that before. Cloak and Dagger is fantastic. Oh my god. Cloak and Dagger is... The fact that the Nunchaku is a first, like, oh my god. Oh god, dude. Cloak and Dagger, yes. Paper Crane, yes. Oh god. Oh goodness gracious. Not like this. Alright, GG guys. GG. I could have won the last one too, man. This would have been a nice streak. I gotta just slow down and think. This is GG, guys. So if I had this upgraded, I could get energy. And Bladeness would pay for itself. If this was upgraded, Bladeness would pay for itself right now. I think Noxious Tomb is pretty important, but I also just... Maybe Noxious Tomb is worth it to play there. But I'm trying not to take damage. I feel like Noxious probably was worth it though. Play. 
We got energy back. Not that I need it now, but whatever. I should probably save that um, poison pot for Grumman, potentially. With Paper Crane, though, we're just... Totally different ballgame. It's popping. It's popping, Jeff. How you doing, bro? You throw your hands up and then Zoid breaks into the chat. Hey, JD, how's the heat over there? I, I didn't realize there was a fire. Well, I don't, I don't think you're close to the fire, but I didn't realize there was a massive fire in North California. And then you're probably not aware it, though. Wait, so is my thing not working? The spider bot? No, but the fires have been getting worse in California. Yeah, some firefighters died, and they're, they're, I read an article that they're saying the firefighters are dying. They don't want to. They don't want to say it's because of exhaustion, but like, like they're they're hinting towards exhaustion because the fires have been worse and more uh, taxing, and there's been a lot of fires back to back, worse than ever. And some of these some of these fires have been working themselves to death. I mean, not to mention these fires are really brutal. So it is sad. It, it is part of climate change, guys. Climate change is real. Have you got Dagger Spray or Dash? I think Dash is the play. Got Slice. We got Infinite Blades with Nunchaku. Let's go for it, guys. I don't like Infinite Blades that much. I actually think Quick Slash is kind of interesting. So if I get Quick Slash on a turn where I have Nunchaku and I can activate it, I can get a card draw and then play... Uh, like, you know, I can get card draw but also get the energy as well. I think I should be careful against Gremlin Nom right now and hope that Neutralize carries me. Okay. We got energy right here. Which means I can draw. Get out some of the defenses. Noxious Tombs is great. I think Infinite Blaze is great. Alright, we're fine. I think Paper Crane's gonna carry this fight anyways against the, uh... What's his name? Guardian that I'm not worried about how much damage I take here. Although I gotta be careful. Ooh, paper crane again. Look at paper crane, guys. Look at paper crane. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just full block. Because with Noxious Humes plus damage, I think we're gonna be just fine. Easy. Not bad. Turn up, fantastic. Deadly poison back up again. Or well laid plans. Well laid plans are obviously really good. Deadly Poison is not bad, but I think we're gonna kind of... This is a tough choice. Another backflip. I think I'm gonna go Wally Plants. Oh, I have Anchor. Holy crap. It's dead? How do I fix that? Let me, let me um... Slow down, I'm cruising. Okay, I, but I... It's, this, I can cruise through this. I can cruise through this, because I have Paper Crane. And Axe 1 is really solid. I can cruise. I mean, I'll slow down when I think it... I'm gonna slow down when I feel like there is a potential for me to get wrecked. Right now, I I slow down with the Gremlin Knob, and I think we're good. That was kind of a mistake, because I could have saved that. Okay, Terra's fine. All right, so we here's what's gonna happen in this fight. Paper Crane's gonna mitigate a lot of damage, so we have to make sure we draw into our um, our um, neutral uh, neutralize as often as possible. I think Blade Dance is going to be really good just to get more damage and Nunchaku, but it's not good against the Reflect phase. In fact, we have a little bit too much offense. We have five strikes. We have Quick Slash, Infinite Blades every turn. But if we just keep holding on with Noxious Zooms, we're fine. All right, so I can go ahead and upgrade either Infinite Blades to make it an innate, which is going to be nice in Act 2, or this to get a little more value with Nunchaku. Now, if I would have saved the Nunchaku from last fight, I would have had a nice little split here. Now I don't have that split. I'm hoping that I'm fine. We're fine. 
Dodge and Rolls gonna be really good. Paper Crane's obviously really good. Infinite Blades is probably not worth it, but here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play this. I'm actually gonna hold on to Dash. This next attack is the biggest one. I could have done Piercing Wheel to play the Shiv, actually. A whole lot of Blade Dance. Because with Infinite Blades, I actually have an extra energy. So Blade Dance gets paid for itself. One, two, three. Boom. Paid for itself. Now I can draw. Boom. We'll hold on to this. It's important that I do backflip as often as possible because it neutralizes like our saving grace. I think Wallet Plays is also a pretty decent upgrade, so I can hold on to two defenses. Neutralize, please. Alright, this is fine though. Eh. Awkward. Wait in space for herself. I'll pierce well now. No reason actually. He was in the proc. See, that was me. I need to slow down there. Cause I could, I could have noticed that. I have lethal here. After image. Oh wow, this deck's this deck's so we can do nightmare? No, after image. Wow. Wow. Choker's bad. I think we can no longer rest, that's fine. It's a little risky, but like, it's the best compared to Choker. Hovercade made you lose? Damn. What's up, Keldra? How you doing, man? Good to see you. Uh, so let me see what's going on with, uh... Let me go miss this building on Justin and see what's going on with the bot. Let me see. Cause so today's power bot is actually a bot from t Twitch. Somebody from Twitch made it, obviously. Fire bot. It's called Spire Info, or whatever. What is it? What is the thing called again? Spire bot. Yeah, it's right here. Okay. Let me message Bill and see what's going on with it. Messaging and see what see what he says.
Wait, did I start this soapbox by talking about climate change? Did I miss, like, this guy's argument about... What are you guys talking about? What, what, what did I ignite? Uh, ignite, that's a funny word to use, but what did I ignite? I mean, there is no argument about climate change. It's just like science. Oh, dishonorably, I'm jealous. Can I have your fan? I'm jealous, dude. Because this, we don't have enough readings to determine whether. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna read it too. We got Skewer. Yeah, I'll take it. I need more defense, though. No, it's, chat's fine. Chat's fine. Chat's fine. Chat's, chat's not doing anything wrong. If we can't have conversations, it's fine. Like, it's not like no one's getting like super political by anything. I think it's fine. Just keep it. Just keep it civil. That's all. Curious, baby Bogdan, where do you feel like they're ignorant or something? Like, you seem to be like a. Uh, almost like you're getting annoyed by it or something. I mean, I know you're getting. I can see they're getting annoyed by it, but. What exactly is annoying you about it? We need defense. Let's talk about the game. All right, guys. Let's, let's, let's talk about the game. Let's, let's stay uh, focused on the game. All right, guys. We had we had a moment to uh, detract. Let's put, let's put the boys. Everybody back in the cage. All right, back in the cage. Yep, yeah, in between infinite blades. Yeah, I think it, I'm really I kind of really digging this um, blade dance change. I'm really digging it. If you guys want to have any discussion, hit, take it over to Discord. Yep. Good idea, guys. Any of those kind of discussions, we can take it over to Discord and chop it up there. We got Snickle Skull. If we get in Venom, that's crazy, but Blur is nice. Let's remove a strike. Sexy. Sexy.
Yeah, Shadow Knight, you're gonna have to give me that seed. You know that, right? I'm gonna need that seed ASAP. Play this is not common now. Play this is not common. I know it's not the craziest change, but I like it. This deck is so good, guys. This deck is so good. I, I find it very hard for me to lose this run, guys. I know I say that before, but, like, guys, I have Paper Crane, Nunchaku, After Image with Shibs. I mean, this deck is... One thing I would need to finesse is, like, I need to get more weakened, right? For Paper Crane. Like, Legs would be fantastic. I'll even take Crippling Cloud. I'll take... Hell. I'll take a, um... Sucker Punch. There's a Sucker Punch. I just talked about this. I said I'll take it. I gotta be a man of my word. I'm gonna take it. I said I'll take it. I'll take it. All right. Let's be honest. Say something, guys. You, you gotta stick with it. Now we could probably want to upgrade after image. Uh, we're fine here. Let's go do this. I should have saved it, Nunchaku, actually. Um, I can take a little bit of damage, it's fine. I'll save the block buff for a better day. Um, I think this is one of those moments where, like, I kind of want to sucker punch this guy. I want to get this guy dead. He's gonna die next turn. I, I, I'll use block cloud here. I hope that next one I have enough defense. Yeah, we're fine. Easy. My teeth are hurting it. I think my wisdom tooth is growing up in the top. You know that feeling when your wisdom teeth are growing in? And like your top your top teeth are getting like pushed or something? Ah. Every time taxi gets energy. Silly said I was shine damage. He didn't see the terror skewer. Silly, you didn't see the terror skewer, did you? I know, I know that I'm shine damage, but I have ways. But uh, yeah, you're right. I need I need some scaling. We have not just zooms is scaling. It's slow, but it's scaling. And we have damage. We have damage here and there. Like our damage is not bad. It's obviously need to be fleshed out. You're yawning. You're yawning, Come, bro. Don't yawn. Dagger spray. Is Nah. Let's dig. Oh, snap. Mango. I'm going for another one. He's doing it. Another aftermage or footwork. A thousand cuts, actually. A thousand cuts, actually. Guys, remember what I said? Like, okay, you gotta think about what this fight needs. Well, what this fight needs is nice, consistent AoE. But footwork's not bad either. Uh, why would it be any better? Um, well, it's not that it's better, but it's like energy is such a really powerful resource, right? So it's really nice that you have energy from Muchaku. It's not better than Kunai or Shuriken. Kunai and Shuriken are very good, but. It's just a really nice relic. So next turn we have a uh, Nunchaku. Nunchaku. 
Nunjaku right here. Bomb. Got a big blur here. Love that I got blur in my deck. Got piercing whale so that we can preserve the blur. Or, you know, mitigate more damage. And then we're, we're killing it. Easy. Nice. Tiny chest. Tools of the trade. That would be cool. Sneaky strike. Like, you start, you draw an extra card, you discard a card, and that activates Sneaky Strike. Like, that's a guaranteed way to get Sneaky Strike activated. Um, aside from that, though, I guess it helps me dig into my deck deeper, which is not bad to find Blur, so I'm gonna do it. I know, you also gotta think about the fact that playing it takes up a turn, and I don't, I'm not that big of a fan of... Like, I'm not the biggest fan of, um, Close to the Trade. But it does activate certain discard stuff that has been recently changed to Uncommon. So we're going to preserve all our lifes, because again, we don't have- Oh, I could have preserved my life anyways with Skewer for zero, so it would have been worth it, actually, to play Infinite Blades or Tools of Trade, because Skewer for zero was fine. Feels bad, man. Let's take Tactician, I know. Not Tacticians on comments. It's not bad, right? And, you know, Reflex and stuff probably don't get enough love either. What's up, good kid? Purple Fruit? This is Turnip, and it makes you no longer become frail. It's pretty nice. I could gamble, I think it's fantastic. We're going for another elite, guys. We're doing elites like crazy. Someone stop me. Someone stop this man. He's out of his mind. Okay, remind me, guys, to update, upgrade uh, after Mitch. There's no reason why I haven't upgraded after image. No reason. Okay. Nelsie, take care, man. Try to get some rest. Tooth is hurting. I'm vulnerable. Uh oh. What's vulnerable to a paper crane? Absolutely nothing. That was silly. I should have waited for. Yeah, that's stupid. Sundial, hell yeah. By the way, Cocular Gamble is a nice way to get Sundial more often. Ooh, I should just kill, huh? Actually, I could have just done she won this guy. I mean, it's okay. I'm not worried about this fight. Like, once those guys are dead, I'm not worried about this fight. Oh my god, Dishonor, dude, you have to give me that seed ASAP. It's crazy. So this is called Nunchaku. Whenever you play 10 attacks, you gain energy. I think Deflect is not bad. I'm down with Deflect. Prepared. After image. 
It's not too bad either. Just to cycle and get into my deck. Cycle my deck more, which basically allows me to do um, Sundial and get also cycle our deck for Blur. Prepare is nice. Wow, we got that from Tiny Chest. Love it. I think Panache is really good. Holy shit. I think Accuracy might be good, actually, guys. I think Accuracy is a nice little way to get some more damage. I know there's Lantern, but Accuracy, you know what? I think it's actually a nice time for me to get some Accuracy. I don't usually say that, but I think Accuracy is pretty good there. I digged. I meant to do Upgrade. Fuck. Um, for this fight, I meant to upgrade there, fuck. For this fight, we are going to, um, and for my next trick, I'm going to try to get Noxious Zooms relatively high, stacked up. I'm going to actually hold on to the Infinite Blades. And my goal is to maybe get a nice big blur before his big execute, and just get Paper Crane. Paper Crane is going to mitigate a lot of damage. And so it's... Yeah, I just want to get Noxious Zoom stacked up a little bit. Okay, we'll play this now. Alright, we'll start doing some, some damage. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to save Terror for the first or second phase. I think I'll just do it on the first phase. I will save it for the second phase, actually. We can't get weakened and we can't get frail. That's crazy. Lost Dishonor, no! Feels bad, man. The final tomorrow feel? Yeah, that's, that's not a good feel. Unless you study your ass up right now. Study your ass up right now, JP, and it's a great feel. I see you studying, boy. We got Sundial, right? Coming up. About to get energy right now? Are we about to get some energy right now? Hell yeah, we are. Alright, so we're gonna split him. I'm just gonna do this 100% differently. What I'm gonna do is Paper Crane's gonna carry me, right? So we're gonna activate his little booty. And then we're gonna go ahead and try to get a big blur. And then Terror on the second phase should be GG. So I get big blur now. I'm vulnerable, that sucks. We need blur. I'm gonna hold on to this weaken for the next turn. We need blur, we got blur. That's fantastic. Let's go ahead and hold on to the weaken for the next turn. Let's activate terror. Let's activate terror. Got blur again. Oh yes. Got yeah, weakened for four turns, that's fantastic. Hold on to this when I have uh, Steroid Pot and Terror. Or I don't even need to Steroid Pot. Yes, GG. Got Terror, where you at? There it is. Let's go, baby. Easy fight. Easy fight. To the follow. Alapant, man, my teeth are hurting me, guys. Ay, ay, ay. Holy crap. Can't be fair, and we get so nice, I know. Ooh, we got malaise and adrenaline. Oh my god, and stormer steel. Okay, malaise is so good. Curse key, fusion hammer. You can no longer smith, so now we can no longer smith or rest. Ah, uh, let's just do curse key. Blur's ridiculous, I know. And our vulnerable makes us take less damage, right? So it's like, our <laughs> we had everything we needed. I didn't even think about Odd Mushroom. That's a good catch. Let's just not be crazy here and do too many leads, because the leads could cuck me still. Like, I think the Giant Head, he can still do some damage. We'll see what happens. I will upgrade after image. I will. I will. 
I dug though. All right, we got a, got a strawberry. That's that's something to scoff at. Holy shit, the teeth are hurting. I have to stop touching it. Yikes. Ah. Vegan run. The old classic. Be sliced, nah. Who's the boss? We're good. Skippy, skippy. Damn, dude. I don't want madness, but. Mmm. These curses, though. Fine. Oh, we got shame. We got specimen. That's not worth it at all. But we can no longer get frail, so it's not that big of a deal. But still, these are curses. I don't want them. Got a reflex, which is not bad for card draw. Although, I think... I think I'm going to remove the writhe. Because, like, I don't care about shame as much. I'm not going to get frail regardless, right? I have prepared to manage that. I actually should probably keep the curses, because I might, I might get a... Uh... Like, you never know. I might actually get, like, do it all or something. That's obviously like wishful thinking. Thank you. I thought I'd better just malaise this guy. Going on with Spire Info Guys. Apparently, Spire Info is up, but it's not. Not up. He has to reload it. He's, he's working on it right now. He's working on it right now. He's fixing it, guys. Now here's the here's the million dollar question, guys. Are we going to use accuracy against the Awakened one or we're not going to do it? I don't like the concept of discarding. is coming back up. Got footwork again. I think footwork, I think, is one of those powers, like, you don't mind taking another one against the Awakened one. Let's upgrade after image, right? I'm not forgetting. Uh, I want to just do malaise. Uh, this is too, too good to pass up. for ice cream. Let's look for um, blur. I also gotta be digging for calipers as well. I should be digging for calipers, look, digging for ice cream. Like there's so many things I should, I should be digging for. I think digging is always worth it.
Look at all that energy, Jesus Christ. Ice cream would be really good though. Oh my god, we're actually taking so much damage. We're letting burns get way too high, guys. I'm probably gonna have to stay red pile at some point. The burns are too strong. Alright, I'm gonna do Nunchaku next turn. Oops. I'm gonna just do Skewer. Hopefully we get like steroid pot. I might just do steroid pot. Let's do it. Endless Agony. Yeah, I don't mind it. Or Dead Branch. I actually don't want Dead Branch. Like... Okay, I know difference is really good, but I actually just don't want to have to deal with keeping my deck going and going and going with the step branch. It's back up, guys. Spire Info is back up. Spire Info your heart away, guys. It's back up. Thank Bill the Unjust. I, I reached out to him and he fixed it. Broken daggers. More sucker punch, right? Because I feel like we don't have enough weaken for all this. No, we do. With malaise, we have definitely enough weaken. Mall bank. Eh. I'm gonna keep digging because we wanna get like no, not that. Thank you, Bill. Appreciate it, man. That's the man, the myth the legend right there, guys. That's the Bill. You guys better be thinking, Bill. We, uh, I don't know if we have damage for this, guys. Noxious Shrooms, I guess. Oh, I meant to do something else. Whoopsies. Thank you for pointing that out, man. Thank you. I'm looking for terror. I was gonna do skewer, but I'm looking for terror. Uh, that's always nice. Thank you guys for pointing that out. Okay, we got the damage, guys. The ships are coming alive. The terror's coming alive. We're good. We got the weekend for days. Got the damage. Everything's okay. No one worry. No more Freddy. The damage is here. No spending probably would have been better. Yeah, you're right. You're you're 100 right. Cardalat, I'm 100 right, dude. I agree with you wholeheartedly, dude. I agree with you wholeheartedly. Skewer for next turn. That's gonna be the way to win, huh? Or what about now? 21 times 4? It's pretty good, but we can make it better. That should be lethal. I should upgrade well they plans to be honest. I 
Actually, I want this guy to die to poison. Ah, whatever. We'll use Ninjaku. Dead Branch. Okay, how crazy is Dead Branch gonna be, though, with all these shifts, guys? Like, I feel like it's gonna be too insane. And I feel like Dead Branch is gonna bloat the deck first off, and then what's gonna happen is that, like, it's also gonna give me powers for the Awakened One. I think it's Dead Branch gonna be pretty bad, guys. I don't think we're gonna get it, guys. I think... I think it's gonna be really bad. Like, bloating's fine, right? But, like, I don't know. I feel like... Nah. That's a no. That's a no for me, son. I know it's good with shivs, but like... I make so many shivs that I feel like it's gonna be... I, I, I've i had this argument before where like... I do agree that most of the time, difference is giving you value in the shivs. Like, a lot of value. And I've had this argument before that it's good. But I feel like the amount of shivs that I have... And the fact that it's a weak one and I don't want to get powers. Maybe I made, maybe I made a mistake. Maybe I dripped it up. No, difference doesn't blow. It doesn't blow. It difference is extremely good, but um. I just feel like the amount of ships that I'm making, it's, it would it would hamper my deck. Because my deck wants to keep cycling into Blur, and it wants to keep, like, getting smaller for Sundial. I just think it would hamper me. Yeah, no, difference is extremely good, it's not on this deck. Yeah, yeah exactly. We don't have to be hostile, guys, baby. We don't have to be hostile. Let's take Blade Dance again. I'm just gonna go for Blade Dance. Let's keep digging. Okay. I think with the with Blade Dance and all the ships that I have, yeah, I don't think it, I don't think it would have been good. Exactly, like in a deck with like Searing Blow or Rampage, like things that like Death Branch is really good, but there are decks where it's like uh it's actually hurting me than more than helping me, right? So I think this is one of those decks. Well, he's also seen me, and I, 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 I do some crazy things with Devranch, so he's, he's seen me. Like, Devranch would be good in this situation, right? Because now I'm in a situation where I don't have use of all my energy, and Devranch would have, and this agony would have been fantastic. Like, there are moments where Devranch was helping me get more out of my turns, because I am actually, you know, getting energy that I can't always use, because I don't have a lot of card draw. So there are turns where it's like, oh, Devranch would be cool here. Because even here, like, Devranch would be kind of nice. But I just feel like on the, on the whole... I mean, I'm not using all my energy, so you could argue that Dead Branch is like card draw, and I'm not to so utilize my energy. But I think I could, I'd rather fix that with like acrobatics. Or just, like, I don't even need to use my energy, right? Like, I can dig for ice cream. Like, yeah, it'd be nice to use my energy, but... I'm also just fine with... Just making sure I consistently defend and do damage. That was a weird sound they made. It's got a wraith form. I don't need it. I think quick slash is helping because I'm not using all my energy. Now, let's keep digging. Doofoodle. Oh shit! I knew I was gonna get something, guys. I should have kept all the curses. I knew I was gonna get Doofoodle. I had a feeling. I just mentioned it just for the hell of it. I didn't actually think I was gonna get it, but it's nice that I did. I think forward is one of those powers that like I'm not mad or I'm not scared about using it because I have paper crane to mitigate this guy's damage the footwork's probably gonna be doing a hell of a lot for me um I'm gonna go on malaise now if 
By the time we get to the second phase, I'm gonna have like a big blur most likely. I'll probably be fine. As long as I make sure I have a, um, a weekend for the second phase, we're fine. I'm not gonna use Noxious Fumes, no need. I'm not gonna use Fumes of the Trade, no need. I'm trying to, trying to not use as many powers as I can. I think Wallet Plains is very nice. But I, I'm debating whether or not I want to use it now. I think I do. Use the bird net. I'm not using accuracy. I, I can save Terra for the second phase. I don't have to save it actually, but. I'm looking for blur, there we go. Yeah, we do some ironclad bends. I would have been good at calculate gamble there. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. I'm just learning from my mistakes, right? I, I feel like I, sometimes I've been dis I've been disrespecting um, the waking one too much. Yeah, but again, plain powers like it just makes it unnecessarily harder for me. It's just not optimal. That's a blur. Damn, feels bad. This, this would be a good time to kill him now. It might be worth to do terror just to kill him so I can get blur for the next turn. It's, not, it's probably worth, but let's see what we draw into. <laughs> it would be worth though to kill him now. Oh, I can save blur for next turn, actually. So, yeah, we'll save blur for next turn. Alright, we'll, we'll hold on to this. Try to find a weaken. Let's play the powers. A lot of energy I didn't utilize. I didn't utilize, but we're gonna kill this guy no problem. I need to weaken. There's the weaken. GG. GG. Should have held on to skew, maybe. Clicking daggers are so good. Paper Crane, yep, Paper Crane's the MVP. Paper Crane's always the MVP. It dominates every run it's in. Let's be honest, accuracy's the real MVP, guys. Let's be honest, alright? It's accuracy. 
YouTube. I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was a nun nunchaku run. I think it's pretty, pretty perfect the way that worked out, right? We had Blade Dance, which is now common, so that just helps us get Nunchaku Valley. And then, of course, Paper Cranes tends to be like the silent little carry on everything. Those little paper little cranes carrying everything. Nice little touch at the end. We do it all. Beautiful.